We just untied from the mooring ball here in this beautiful little bay. And today we're on our way out to Richelieu Rock, a very popular dive site in the Andaman Sea. Richelieu Rock rises up from a depth of 50 metres up to the surface. The horseshoe shaped reef is known for its purple corals and diverse marine life. The reef is 10 nautical miles east from Surin Islands and a part of the Mu Ko Surin Marine Park. It took just under two hours to get here from the west side of the Surin Islands. So we just arrived out at Richard Luke Rock and uh, we're just drifting around. There's no actual island or rock sticking out of the water, it's just a, um, it's all underwater. There is one, two, three, four, five dive boats out here. And Bella and Lee are just going to have to have a look in the tender. So what we're going to do is because the boat is drifting, we'll do two people diving at a time. So Bella and Lee will go and then Taj and I'll go. But the water doesn't look that great. This is supposed to be the best dive site in Thailand. And I don't know. The water clarity, you never know. Looks can be deceiving, they say. But we're just drifting about. The weather's kind of nice, so we've been able to come out here today, which was good. And um, we'll see what the verdict is when they come back. Here they are, they're back. What's it look like? Are you joking? No. The dive is all down, but... It was like, there was a rock that was like a meter under the water and you couldn't even see it. Really? Yeah. Is it the wrong time of day or...? We didn't have full tanks, but we were saving the air that we had for this dive. We've read up on this place and it's pretty highly rated, so we wanted to check it out. We geared up, first in was Lee and Bella.
was it, guys? It was unbelievable. The life down there, the water clarity wasn't there, but oh, it didn't matter. There's barracuda longer than me. I had about six of them beside me, like within this close, like a few to me away. And uh, oh, just everything, everything was supersized. Trevally, um, all the coral trout were like this big. They wouldn't even move out of your road. You almost have to push everything out of your road. They're just so used to divers. It's, it's unbelievable. I'm gonna get Sarah down there now and see what she reckons. Mine and Taji's turn. Oh, Belle. Excited. Bella and I have had our dive and it was unbelievable. There's so much life down here like I said before. Now um, Sarah and Hart going down to have a go. We're taking turns because in the background Bella's actually just a drift out there. We, we weren't able to get a mooring. There's only two mooring boys out here but we rafted up once and then a bigger boat came along so um, yeah. I'll just stay floating and wait for them to pop back up. We got a nice bright yellow safety sausage. Good luck guys. Have fun. A good dive or what? It was a good dive. That was a pretty cool dive. That was pretty amazing. You see the barracudas? I ah. saw them when we first went down. Yeah, didn't see them. Oh, they, they were, were massive. massive. I saw when I went free. Yeah. Home. They were massive when we first went down. Did you see the big trevallies? Yeah, they were massive. Everywhere. Perfect diving. Wish we could have done it all together. Okay. But maybe we'll uh, be able to get our tanks filled. We can come out and do another one. We got back to another little bay before sunset and headed ashore to cook up some dinner.
We got five, baby. We got five, baby. It's another magical day here in Thailand. We just come over to the beach for an afternoon fire. Got some potatoes, a few spuds to put in there, and uh, some veggies. I think we've got some, mash some marshmallows to roast as well. Look at this sun going down. Beautiful bay. Oh, careful. What the? What the fuck is that? Sorry, you might go pop. It's just a little lucky. <laughs> <laughs> They're crappy ones. This real nice, babe. Please don't pass me by. Cause my heart just can't let you. Alright guys, so I've just separated the fire. We had our fire pit going. I've just pulled pretty much just the coals aside. It's not a real interesting dinner tonight. We've actually been diving with the fish and not hunting the fish. That's just spuds and a little bit of salad tonight. We'll get those on these coals here. Give them half an hour and we'll head back to the boat after we've toasted a few marshmallows. There's a biscuit in there too. <laughs> and she's put a bit of cookie dough in there too. <laughs> so uh, get those spuds in there, mama. Just throw them in oh, a little bit more care. No, it's hot, but... It's a bit hot. Try to keep it in the center, away from the sand, as you do. We've got some zucchini and eggplant as well, but I think they'll take Beautiful. less to cook. That, eh? Whoa, it's so hot right here. So we'll pull our fire back down again. Keep that going. So I was just sugar coma over here. He's had 3,000 marshmallows. Righto guys, thanks for tuning in. That was another great episode, we think anyway. But I uh, hope you enjoyed. If you like it, thumbs up. If you haven't already subscribed, please subscribe guys. That will help us grow. Press the little notification bell so you can see every time a new video comes out. And we'll see you next time. We love you. Bye. Bye.